everyone welcome back to banner saga let's try talking to the king of varl about the bridge you'll do as i say i'm not here to argue i'm telling you that we're dying by dozens every day now you sent our best away with haken how long do you expect us to last you ask for this command, Fasold. Don't let them get across that bridge. Fasold takes his leave just as you approach. Not great timing, you think of yourself. Thank you for your audience. I forgot your name. Rook. Rook. How is Ingvar? Will he survive? I think so. If I remember Ingvar well enough, he hasn't told you why he faced down the lower, did he? Mm hmm. No, I would be interested to hear. Ingvar confronted Asundor in his youth during the Great Wars. He won that fight. None other but the mentors have done that. He proved us stronger. Maybe he thought to do it again. Ivar killed Asundor? How did he end up in Skolgor? You'd have to pry that from him yourself. I don't know. He disappeared when the last king tried to name him Kandra. It occurs to you that Jorund would not be on the throne now had that happened. But why are you here, Rook? Be brief. Um, I'm offering to help take apart the bridge. Human, if there is one more mention of that bridge, Jorund's mood changes almost instantly. If you have nothing else to say, get out of my damned hole. We are all at stake here. Oh, you have the answers. Wonderful. Come, sit upon the throne. Every man I've ever met thinks he'd rival the gods himself. If only he were in charge. I am over 400 years old and I know that I know little. You are a child, an infant, yet you know everything. Listen, human, this story is not about you. If you jumped from that bridge today, the world, the world would not change. Now either help Fassel to retake it or leave my city. I don't care which. Guards are quick to usher you from the Great Hall. You don't resist. We can either fight, destroy, or leave. <laughs> it's destroyed. Eowyn nods when you tell him you'll help destroy the bridge. He reminds you of the plan. Get him out onto the bridge and give him time to strike it until it falls. Hold off anyone who comes to stop him, Dredge or Varl alike. Are you ready? We are ready. You follow Eowyn to the bridge, where the Varl are lined up to join battle. They readily let you step in for the next group, curious to watch the men they fight. When you've killed a few, I'll begin, Eowyn whispers. So we'll take Fassel and we'll take Krum with us. Oh, he's level 5. Plus, he's for level 5, yeah. What do you have? Dodge. Give you some more strength. I'll give you dodge. I'll give this to you. Oh no, we don't have. Well, we have me ten, right? Yep. Yeah. Okay. There's nothing else we can do. But I saw a let, yep. They need to be there over there. One, two slingers. But I want the two of you like this. How far can he go? Far enough to hit me. So we'll wait for them. Can you use the lightning? Ok, 
Okay, you help him. And you start hitting him. Oh god damn it, seriously! Okay, but we're open. Okay, you stay here. Okay, you want him to block both of those guys? Forge ahead? So you need to move forward, oh. Well, he does more damage. <laughs> but he goes first. Okay, that was a mistake, I guess. No? Okay. Actually kill him! Of course they all going for a wind. They run away. Or try to keep him alive. Let's make it like this so he can get through. Next one. We really need to invest in break. His armor. Ooh. Okay, but I think we can make it work. I was thought he was supposed to art uh, to hit the others as well. Please, hit it, hit it, hit it! Yes! Oh no. Oh! Well, uh, maybe you should... Oh, we can hit him. I'm so glad that they, that they don't go for a wind. Oh no. Okay. Which one? Okay, this one's go first. Go for this one. Oh, I'm sorry. How did that work? But uh. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Uh. hit his armor. That's actually good. Look like this. Ok, 
Okay, once again. Ah! Are quite new, thank you. Okay, I have no idea how it works. Over here. Okay, you need to back up, back off, mm. and we need to start mending. One for odd leaf, rank to restore, restore screen man power, so it's fine. Oh, ah! For some reason, I was sure <laughs> he restores health, not armor. Ah, what the hell? Rest, rest, mend, and mend his armor. And you kill him. Only Rook got hurt, right? At, the bre at a break in the fighting, a wind starts to rain down lightning at one of the bridge's supports further ahead. Dredge respond with confusion, shuffling away from the area. Then the Pharaoh notice. What are you doing? Shouts Fassel, several more. Pharaoh join him. a wind is locked on his task. Another lightning strike, sending Rabu into the air. Stop! Shouts Fassel, drawing his weapon. The others follow suit, ready to attack. Defend him. Stay close, you tell the others, drawing your axe. Alit is shaking so hard that you can see it from a distance. If a shot, shout, puzzled attacks. Okay, but we still have crime <laughs> with us. Okay, we need you to... Yep. We want you to be able to break a lot of armor. Yep. No one should be able to break a lot of armor. Let's take Hagun. And let's take Mogun, I guess. Because we can. Okay. And there's no one we can equip with the. Oh, God damn it, with Ivar's belt. This is how we do it. <laughs> and we ba oh, we can back and she but we won't appreciate, won't, won't want to <laughs> shoot them. Twenty, ah, it hurts. Oh, and he has the item I gave him. get hurt for doing that. It's a shame that I couldn't decide on the strength this attack, but well. 
want him here and I want bloody flail. Who's next? He's next. So maybe I should do it as well. Ooh, we don't have men there with us. And let me guess, Alec doesn't want to... Oh, she said nothing. But this guy is next. Uh, he's on free, so I don't care about that too much. The, this guy is next. Somehow I'm not surprised. Again. No, no, no. Don't do that. Uh, bloody flail. This is great for just jumping them. Especially if it hits. Oh. If it hits. Armor. Yeah, I, I have to think about that. Him. I think we're in a bad spot. Okay, he's next. Please. We need to get their armor down. Oh no. He's going next. Now this one. Oh, we don't have any renown. He's probably down for. No, he went for it. What do you have for your head? Hmm. Okay, he didn't fall. That's good. I need him to tank as much as he can. Okay, there's that. Who's next? This guy. Wait, it's five right now? So, well, we'll do that. Hit him. Get his arm off. Oh. 
Everyone's fine. She may be able to kill him. Yep. I know, but I have to kill someone to get to go away with that. Dead the foul lie at your feet, their blood on your hands. You're pulled from the creeping of revolution by a thunder's crack, and suddenly a wind is rushing past. Run! He screams. The stone wall crumbles behind you, and the other vow flee for your lives as the bridge collapses around itself into the deep abyss beneath. The dread who have not been taken with it scramble over each other to outrun the collapse. When the dust and snow clears, you can see a yawning gulf between you and the dredge. They won't be crossing it again. The wolf hands from a screaming mob of our pull you from the ground to the great hall. There was there just was there not just one thing I demanded of you? Yoron launches from his throne, pointing an axe in your direction. You've broken this alliance, human. Men and Val are no friend to each other anymore. This is my reward for allowing men in Einartoft. Do not blame all humanity for my... There's a bustle from the back of the hall. The Val part around a shadow figure entering the room. Yurund, enough. This fight could not have been won. They did what you were unwilling to do. Enough of this insolence. I want these people out of my city. You would gladly let you our whole race die? There is nothing glad about it. There are no more Varl being made tomorrow or a thousand years from now. We are all there is and we will all be gone someday. You've destroyed what we have made. What else is left of us? We will leave no trace behind? As if we never existed? We have nothing left but ruins. Now get out of what is left of my land. End my city and never return. The guards pull you roughly from the great hall when your caravan has been hastily gathered together. Of our bones, the hills. Stop! A little voice calls from somewhere in front of you. The surrounding terrain comes alive with armed fighters surrounding the caravan. No need for bloodshed, the leader says. Leave a couple wagons and pretend you never stopped here. Mm, you can't remember the judge. I'm guessing you have no idea that we are on the way. If that's the case, friend, says the leader, we need those supplies more than ever without even glance to this man the attack begins. And I have so many injured. Yeah. Uh, let's see, we'll take Ifer instead of Alet. That's for sure. Uh, how much do we have for now? 10. Okay. And go for the break because this is most what I use archers for. Mm, I'll give you some dodge. And I'll give. Oh, again, okay, I cannot give you some armor. Free, free. He has from one. Give this to you, and I give this to you. Unless I can take those. Okay, let's try it. <laughs> I hope it's not gonna end horribly. 
Okay, so we are on the outside ring. And I actually like how they are over. But I would like someone over here. Ready. Because I wanted to bleed those archers as fast as possible. Okay, just five armor just like that. Okay, you need to move, so let's move you over here. Really? Leave the old man. Oh. Wait, how? Forge ahead, okay. I keep forgetting about some of those abilities. Okay. That's good. Thank you for coming here. They really hate him. Okay, he has to go. Thank you. Well, I guess this is what this happens when you play on normal difficulty. Yeah, he's down. Injured, this entrepreneur, so you have to heal the injured, but will he die once he's down? Because he will be down. Like, is he dead now or. They have lots of renown. It's a lot harder to block humans than Varlan. Okay, he's injured again. We have 20 days worth of supplies. If we hit uh, low morale, we can camp and we'll heal. Amnar, the quirky old man with the leather headband says, If there's one thing I know better than woman and meat, it's... Well... He smells... Well, nothing! <laughs> but I know when a group could use some help. Just not and let old Unar make everything better. No questions now. Uh, okay... That evening, Unar clears his throat and loudly recites a tale of travelers ending with war and death behind them. Seeking hope is then they carried on with courage, using heart and head. A strange poem, but Kravan is happy for a change of pace. Unnar bows and turns to assist the cooks. The evening's meal is larger than ever, yet the supply wagons seem more full than before. You look to thank Unnar, but he is gone. We are camping. <laughs> Yeah, we need to take care of Krumr. Oh, it's three days. It's minus three in battle. We can rest twice, I think. Which leaves Krumr at minus one strength, but everyone else is healed. Good. Okay, we can leave. 
Minus one strength isn't as painful as minus three. It appears that large figures following from the direction of Ain are toast. Otliff watches intently before finally saying, They have a cart. I can hear it. You slow to get up at a few and spy a small caravan of Varl. Eventually, they catch up. Greetings, Ivor. It's been quite a while since we talked, hasn't it? I know you. Ubin? Never imagined you to be one to defy the king. What made you leave? Someone had to. What do you mean? Bellower is heading this way. Already? How is that possible? A group of Thrall from Wormtoe showed up around the back of Einartov. The long way. Bellower and his army chased them across the summer path, they say. Past Wormtoe? That doesn't make any sense. Bellower was at the bridge. He must have doubled back after that serpent appeared. While we fought on that on the bridge, he led half his forces around to approach Einar Toft from behind. The attack on the bridge was a feint. Don't, don't let anyone tell you the dredge aren't clever. Einar Toft will fall within a day. Maybe not. He's following you. I thought one of you might know why. We exchange nervous glances, but nobody speaks up. Must be me, then. Is there something I don't know? That's quite a grudge he's holding if he's coming for you, Ivor. It doesn't matter. All, our only chance is to get to sing her home. Juno will know what to do. We'll join you. I comparing supplies and warriors who will be happy to kill a wretch or two, I believe. Oh, there's still a lot more clansmen than any fighters or Varl. The caravan stops at a split in the road. Ahead, the path leading to Sring Home rears off into the hills, which are now swimming with familiar black shapes. Dredge that way too, promises Eowind. The summer path leads straight to Sring Single Home while taking the measure route out several days. They're every way by now, replies Abin. I suggest we go around past Hawkstorp. Mm, go ahead, go around, yeah. I hate to say it, but I'm not willing to walk into swarms of dredge anymore. Juno will have to wait. You turn toward the long round around Hawkstorp instead, hoping you've saved lives in the process. As goes shout, some giant hole, but it's empty. You approach the structure, but recognize none of the markings. The walls seem unsteady at best. Finally, sleeping be beneath a roof, you overhear. Several families begin unpacking. Yeah, keep up and back until you're certain and safe. Several volunteers search the building with weapons drawn. Just as they are announcing an all clear, a viral leans against the support, which gives way and a third of the structure crumbles. Luckily, no one is injured, but you leave the crumble crumbling building behind. You enter a village of miners who want to know what has been happening recently between the rumblings of the quake and the sightings of dredge in the distance. As you look around, you see a lot of elderly and children, and know that these people will only be more mouths to feed. Let them make their own decision. You welcome anyone who wishes to join caravan. Many do, while others choose to stay in their homes and see things through. You wish them luck. Okay, and that's a good place to end this part, so thank you very much, stay alive and see you soon, bye!